later, I am going out with my lovely, lovely husband for a meal at the Sofitel number 35. And this is the dress that I bought for $50 down the Gold Coast and a few people wanted to see me in it. Well, here we are. I love it. I feel sexy in it. Um, I've got my Nine West shoes, so I kept it not very high today. This does have a slip under it, so if it looks like it hasn't, no, it's not indecent. It does have a slip. Sheer up here, halter neck. Let me just turn around slowly. Yeah, so very nice dress. And it's sort of like, I don't know if anyone can see, it's like a navy blue. And these panels are sheer mesh, sort of skin toned. And I have my beautiful Louis Vuitton favorite girl that I unboxed the other day, so she's coming along. And I borrowed my husband's scarf from Rod and Gun because I didn't have anything that I could wear at the top, so I'm just going to wear that as a wrap if it gets cold. So come with us to dinner. We are going to have a glass of Tattinger. Love the Tattinger. Every time we come here, we have Tattinger. Here we are at number 35 at the Sofitel and it's one of our favourite spots in Melbourne. We have a history with it, we love it, we've had some good times here. So we're looking, he's looking at the menu and you're, have you decided what you're going to have darling? No, not really. Well I have decided what I'm having and I love the view out there, how gorgeous is that. I'm going to have, I have to eat gluten free, I'm going to have my oysters which I love. And I'm going to have my slow cooked lamb, which is gluten free. And we're going to have a glass of white wine. Have you decided what white wine? Yes, I have. Good. Which one, honey? We're we'll doing a dog point. Dog Maybe point? Now. Yep, dog <laughs> point. I love the name. That's why I couldn't get it. Where's they from? Oh, of course, it's the Mulberry region in New Zealand. Where oh, it yes, be. yes, yes. Honey, yeah. you are looking very sharp. Suave and Thank good you. looking tonight, honey. You say that as if I wouldn't. Be. You're looking very ooh la la. Okay, darling, just to match you then, obviously. Yeah, I have to show you my beautiful favourite bag. My girl has a little seat of her own, so I love it. The Sofitel, they actually give you a bag. What do you call it? A bag stool, yes. And they do that in New York too. So yes, so we have our bread, my gluten-free bread, and your beautiful bread, and some olives, so very nice. And the wine we're having is called Dog Point. Okay, I'm having my oysters, which are the natural ones, because I have to make sure they're gluten-free, and with the lemon, so I love my oysters. I've had, I don't know, I just have loved oysters for a long time. Full of zinc. I don't really have them because they're healthy, I have them because I love them. And you have, what do you have? Beetroot carpaccio. Yummy, what's that white bit? That's the mozzarella cheese, oh, the beetroot's okay. down the bottom, and then there's figs. Um, nuts, etc. And cheers to our Dog Point wine. Yay! From New Zealand? Yes. Okay. Here we are with our next course. I have slow cooked lamb with some roasted potatoes in rosemary and steak with bone marrow and mashed potato and is it cabbage? It's cabbage, yep. Cabbage, so ooh la la. I am so enjoying this meal. Hey, we are, well I am having cheesecake. Was it lemon? I think it's lemon. So, no, what was it? Just cheesecake, I don't know what flavor. Vanilla? 
No, I think it was more strawberry or something. No, it wasn't strawberry. Mm. No, 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 no. You're confused with the lemon um, tart. Yeah, it wasn't lemon, but it was, I mean, I think it might be vanilla. I don't remember strawberry. Where'd you get that from? <laughs> I made it up. Well, I obviously made up the lemon tart. So we're going to share one of those. We were both wrong. It's not strawberry. Or it's not vanilla, it's apple. Mm. Oh, it's so light. It's like a souffle. Next one. Good. So low for the camera. <laughs> All working in the kitchen. So that was a really nice meal. We're now going to go and just have our last nightcap before we go to bed. Over on the view out here, isn't that gorgeous? Okay, our nightcap is here, so here comes the cognac. So, this is a cognac one. So, we've got three different cognacs that we're tasting. We've got the Hennessy VS, which oh, is yeah. very special. Yep. Um, very special old. And EXO is extra old. Oh yeah. Okay. Yep. You like cognac yourself? I love cognac. Oh good. Good to taste. <laughs> yeah. What I might do is I'll give you a, a little glass of boiling water as well on the side. Oh, yep. Cool. What yep. we can do is just heat it if we need to. It's always fine drinking cognac out of a warm glass. It's much nicer. Uh, right. And you've got the Remy VSOP which I'll put in the middle for you. So have you tried tried any of these before? The Hennessy. The Hennessy? Yeah. There's actually what we've got in the back as well is a Louis Louis tray. Louis? Yeah. Uh, so that's um Yeah, no, it's that was fun. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like the King Louis. So it's is that expensive that one? Off. It's about $180 a net. Yeah, for Ooh, sure. Yeah. It'll be beautiful. Yeah, it's it's very, very nice. How gorgeous does that look? Mm. Cognac. And grand marinara. Cognac and grand marinara. <coughs> so that makes the charm the taste better. Yep. And the cognac tastes better. Yep. Ooh la la. Off we go. Taste testing, here we come. So do you want the first taste huh? So which one is this, do you know? Uh, I think that's the, that's the um, really old one, the 50 year old. It's beautiful, really, really warm. Yeah, so this is heating it up to make it taste better or to make to the flavours? To warm the glass so that you keep it warm so you get flavors, the better flavours come yep. out. Yep. It's the after effect, it just goes down and warms you so much. One's a different taste. Yeah, so that's the mid-range. So we started with the best. Was the, the best, one. you can tell the difference. Yeah. You try that and see what you think. Definitely tell the difference. I don't think that one's as nice. It's more like a harsh alcohol. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's not greatly different, but it's not. Oh, I think it is. It's got a much stronger afterwards. It's nowhere near as smooth. That's it. So it let's, is. let's warm up the last one, then we'll finish off. Don't worry, everybody. We will finish this off. You don't have to worry. Let's try it since I've got the camera on you. Oh, I'm the star tonight. You are the star, yes. Oh, it smells different. Is it? Mm. It's similar, but you can smell that it's different. Right. I didn't like the middle one as much. Well, I assume I'm not going to like the middle one. Yeah, that's probably slightly better than the middle one. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Drink it all. I don't think she likes it by look on her face. No, I do. I do so like that's the Hennessy. That's what yeah. you've, you've had before. I liked a better quality one. 
it's strange that. Typical, I'm a very, yes, I tend to always go for the expensive things, don't I? Oh really, I've never noticed that. Hi Natty. We had contact with Natty and Ronnie. Oh, I can smell the orange. Look at the little shot glasses, they're gorgeous. Mmm, very nice. Look at Cheers. Oh, jeez. This could become my new favourite drink. No, it's very strong. Definitely is just a night cap. I prefer Grand Marion uh, out of over the cotton. Yeah, I do too. But mm. that's only because it's got a flavour and oh, it's not quite it's as nice strong. One. Yep, very nice. Move on to the next one. Oh, it's different. So what's that one again? One was the coffee one, wasn't it? Coffee's the last one. Right. Oh, the smells similar but subtly different. That's quite different. It'll be so, interesting to see what you think. This one's really nice. You like that one? What do you think? It's nice, yeah. In between. So you go for the last one, Doc. Which is the coffee one? Well, he suggested there was hints of coffee. The auto is insane to me now. Right. You're not getting the hint? Okay. It's quite strong. Oh, yeah, they're, they're very different. Are they? Mm. Mm, pretty, I can't taste it now. No, but I'm just going by the smell. Yeah. Do you think that one's more? I think the middle one. I think the middle one's the, the best of the lot. The know, first I, in I the like, middle. I think I like probably the last one. It, look, it's a smoother taste. Yeah. But it's a flatter taste. It doesn't have much. I think because we've had too much of the other stuff now, mm. it's harder to. You get this burning thing down your throat, but it's actually quite um, mm. nice. It's relaxing. The taste is very strong. You get this burn. That's what I like about it. But yeah, it's got a very strong after. This is more the orange one, which I quite like. Yeah. So we will finish on the Grand Maranara taste testing or flight. So don't forget everyone, Ada Love Style, and see you again tomorrow. Girlfriend, ladies are lunching tomorrow. See you then. Bye. Forget everyone, Ada Love Style.